What's going on, guys? Merrick here, back with another episode of our Liquid Crystal Hardcore Nuzlocke. Last episode, we had a another interruption from another of these fan-made characters, smacked him up, and then we came to do some shit over in Mahogany Town, up here on Route 43, got ourselves a nice little giraffe rig, and uh, we've got some trainers to finish battling before we get up to the Red Gyarados. Uh, so we're gonna go ahead and get them out of the way here. Some serious guy made fun of me. <laughs> why so serious? And Nitto King. That's why. Look at that beautiful monster. That's why I put Darf out front. I was gonna put Nitto Queen. Have Nitto Queen versus Nitto King, but he doesn't. She doesn't have any moves to really do much. Uh, so I was just like, you know what? Just get him up out. And Darf's like, nah, this is my queen over here. Get away from her. I'm gonna put Spectre out front. I forgot Spectre has Ice Punch, too. That was just kind of for the fuck of... Alright. I'm pretty sure a Shadow Ball won't kill. And that's why we did not stay in. My Gengar. I have faith in Gengar. But Slowbro is pretty fucking fat. I know it's physically defensive, but it wasn't worth taking the risk. There was much more risk of Gengar getting just straight up murdered. straight up, like, change this shit. What the hell? It does kind of seem more like a crater, but seems very dried out. I guess I can't be mad. That might come in handy at some point. Could have been a worse item, I suppose. Ba da ba ba da ba. Ba 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 ba. candy okay um i'll hold on to that for you know grinding at some point okay so it's like a dog the gyarados are angry it's a bad omen they built this platform so us fishers can fish better okay all right so tinglebird why are you this time I know I have a potion. Is there a chance we can get anything else besides a, uh, a Gyarados or a Magikarp in this lake? Because I just realized we've got a, there's a Lake Rage encounter. And then there's the static red Gyarados. Oh, uh, yeah, they built this platform to make it better to fish. Does not seem... Okay. So... 
I'm gonna guess it's a no. Alright. Where the frick? That basically takes you straight out to the middle of the lake. So I'm sure the Gyarados is probably to the left, but what's over here? Oh my shit. He's just like, why do you keep sending me out? Alright, yeah, it doesn't look like there's anything. I didn't think there would be, but who the f fuck knows? Especially with this, this added stuff. Like, I know there's a few more trainers up here, too. And I'll probably just come back and battle them. Well, I'd say for a montage, but I don't really need to. I don't need to do any grinding, really, so... Alright, so there's the red Gyarados. Let's go ahead and save. <sighs> Sad part is I don't even know if I'm going to use it. I want to because it's shiny. It's the red fucking Gyarados, which is easily one of the best shinies. Whoa, do not do that. At the same time, I don't. Who the fuck do I have to take off my team? And I have Darf, and I'm not replacing Darf. I don't know though. It's Red Gyarados. Okay, it's got big boy moves. Okay, Leer does not affect. Leer does not do anything to assist Dragon Rage. Let's go ahead and catch it in our one netball. We have a lure ball, but netball works. It's fitting. I love the three water type specific Pokeballs. They just look dope. Netball, dive ball, lure ball. The atrocious Pokemon. It has an extremely aggressive nature. The hyper beam it shoots from its mouth totally incinerates all targets. So it's red. I usually name Epion, but you know what? This time around, I'm going to name it something different. Astraea. I thought it was going to disappear, I was like, uh, <laughs> hey, are you going to get in the goddamn Pokeball? <laughs> Don't do this. Don't do this to yourself. Let's, let's just get back. Ah. I need to not have Dingleberg out front anyways. I need to get an item for for Spectre. Whether it be like a, something to boost his damage output, Black Sludge for that healing. Hell, even leftovers. I mean, well, I put leftovers on somebody else, but oh yeah, it's Lance. I'll give him a voice. This lake is full of Gyarados, but nothing else. So the Magikarp are being forced to evolve. Did you come here because of the rumors? You're Merrick. I'm Lance, a trainer like you. 
A trainer like me, huh? I heard some rumors, so I came to investigate. I saw the way you battled earlier. I can tell that you're a trainer with considerable skill. If you don't mind, could you help me investigate? I'm a member of the Pokemon G team. You're G men. What the hell is it they were called in the anime? Excellent. It seems that the lake's Magikarp are being forced to evolve. A mysterious radio broadcast coming from Mahogany is the cause. I'll be waiting for you. You know, that's one of those things that, like, I never understood, so, um, you know, Lance goes with you to deal with Mahogany Town and the Lake of Rage, but I feel like it just, I feel like he should have also, like, been there to tag along and help you out with the radio tower, especially since the two are, you know, the two incidents are connected. And, I mean, that's basically like him just leaving the job half-finished. <sighs> and, of course, this one's a Kangaskhan, too. What took you, Merrick? Just as I thought, that strange radio signal is coming from here. Merrick, we should split up to check this place. I'll go first. Okay. Dun -dun -dun. Team Rocket always had just such good music for their hideouts. I don't really care so much for the battle music, but... Alright, level 28. Spectre should be able to handle this. Emergency! There's some kid running around fucking everybody's faces with a gang with a ghost. Hey, I got an answer for that too. Instead of ice punch, they should call it frosty fisted. No? I suppose that could be interpreted as something else. Oh, it's gonna take us some time to get through all these fucks. That's okay. Oh, it didn't pause the music. Okay, or it did pause the music. I thought the music usually plays in the background. I must be thinking of a newer gen. Okay, we're not gonna play games with you. Okay, I was gonna say, Rattata doesn't get pursued, right? Bum, bum, ba da dum, bum, ba da dum, bum, ba da dum. Actually, yeah, I may as well just stay in. I'm immune to its stab. I resist normal type shits. I don't think a single Pokemon has landed disabled. I think someone disabled their disabled. I feel like even though you would think Thundershock should do more from a Magneton, Spark is still better. Yeah, it's 90, 90 special attack versus 70 physical attack. And it's 40 to 65. So I don't know. I'd have to calculate the actual math there. But maybe I'll whip out a damage calculator at some point. Not really relevant until he decides to try and learn Thunderbolt, anyways. And we can get a an, 
counter over there. This was once a ninja hideout. Oh, interesting. I said it was interesting because I thought I had my Magneton out front. Turns out I had my Gengar out front. So it was a lot less interesting. Thunder wave. You better fucking behave. Gonna eat this fire punch for a spicy lunch. It's too late to be rhyming. Another Magmite. Alright. Good team, dude. Bag. That was exciting and totally worth. Let's do this. We'll battle them, we'll battle that guy, and then we'll get that encounter out of the way. And then probably just go heal. We'll go heal and then we'll come back. See, this is this is a lot easier too when they're uh, especially for these grunts because they're all gonna have the same Pokemon so it's very predictable and I can sit here and go okay I know that Spectre can handle both of these mods and then with the second one we'll of course switch out Kill the zoo app, and then I think we switch to Magnemite or Magneton rather. Ba 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 ba. My throat is dry as shit. I'm drinking this coconut water, and it's not helping. I think I'm gonna have to get my Baja Blast out of the freezer. They sell the other Bajas in my area. But not Baja Blast. So my lovely wife has to buy them from me from for me from work. Focus energy. Is he focus energy for quick attack again? Yes. Got the crit that time. Grimer, so we stayed in. So right now, Spectre and Dingleberg are just slaughtering Team Rocket. Ooh, got the paralysis. And I did. Dingleberg to not take a lot of damage because Dingleberg is our encounter mod. Rotata. <sighs> I don't know if it gets like bite. I'm sure it gets bite, but I don't know if it gets crunch. It's like I'm just trying to not push it. Especially because there's no chance I'll ever get another Gengar.
This is fine, though. So Magneton's one of those weird Pokemon I've liked since Gen 1. I just thought it was a cool Pokemon. And then... Like, even with the cards, we got a, we got a pretty dope-looking one in base set. We got to even... I think the art looks cooler in the fossil art, even though the foiling's not as shiny. And it's like, Magneton went from being a cool, bulky electric type to getting a new typing in steel. Level 18, what the fuck? And... Just being even better, and I and I, I love that for him. I don't actually think there's really anything to. Where's my berry shit? chance that I do need the sturdy. Oh, it's a coughing. Sturdy would not really be necessary, but it'd be helpful. But I already have a coughing. Uh, already have a snowball. I have a feeling they're all going to be the same. That is not the same. <sighs> is this the generation where you can or can't Thunder Wave? It is the one where you can. So we got Sonic Boom. All right, and Pokeball. If I had an actual Pokeball, but I don't. See, now it's kind of annoying because then we've got the electrode that are in further in this bit. Well, I guess, no. Well, they're static, though. Those are static. This counts as the encounter for the... whatever. Life form whose identity is unknown. Is it said to screech or suddenly self-destruct? Either way. Jeremy. Alright, let's go ahead and get out of here. Let's go heal up. And then we will continue our raid of Team Rocket's hideout in Mahogany Town on the next episode. So if you enjoyed, we'll go ahead and throw some love to that like button down below. Show some support. If you enjoyed, if you didn't, well, I'm sorry. I'm enjoying playing the game either way, so. Always remember to save your game, because if you are to lose that data, it would be a shame. And uh, we're apparently never going to have a different outro phrase, so we'll see you guys in the next episode. <laughs>